All right, awesome. Um, what we're, what I want to do right now is, you know, blah, 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 blah. I want to show you how to solve this for x, right? So the main important thing that we want to do when solving this problem for x is we need to understand what exactly a logarithm represents. So what I always like to remember is log base 3 of 9 equals 2. And the way that I remember that is because 3 raised to the second power equals 9. So that's one thing that I can always remember for me because a lot of times, you know, I forget too. How, what does a logarithm represent? Well, it represents 3 raised to what number equals 9? Well, that answer is 2. So for this problem, I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to rewrite 81 to the 3 fourths equals x. Now, what do we do from here? How do you solve 81 to the 3 fourths? Well, there's a couple things we could do this for. Um, a couple ways we could remember this. Hopefully, if you know that, um, you know, 16 to the 1 half, anything to the uh, 1 half power, that means the square root of 16 to the first, which we know the square root of 16 is 4. So we could write this as the fourth root of 81 to the third power equals x. Now, to a lot of you might say, okay, well, I can get my calculator. I'll do, you know, fourth root of 81 to the third. But some of you might not have a calculator with the test, and you're going to be kind of stuck. So what do we do from here? Well, what we could do is I could see uh, what other ways could I rewrite 81. And what I could do is I could see, well, I can rewrite 81 as 3 to the fourth power. So 3 to the 4th power is equal to 81, and that's going to be times my 3 fourths, which equals x. Now, this is so powerful because why is it important that I could write 81 as 3 to the 4th? Well, now I can use my power, power rule of exponents to multiply 4 over 1 times 3 over 4, which equals x. Well, 4 over 1 times 3 fourths, the 4s cancel out, so you end up getting 3 cubed equals x, so 27 equals x. And there you go. That's how you get your answer.